In previous episodes, we learned about cruiser's scariest moment at sea and weather forecasting systems used. Now it is time to find out cruiser's thoughts on what is crucial for safety at sea. If you enjoy this series, give us the thumbs up, subscribe and turn your notifications on. For me, we always have your life jacket on when you're um, on deck. I would say the big thing is uh, planning your trip to miss bad weather. Uh, preparing your boat and the crew so that the boat is fit for purpose and the crew are fit for purpose, trained and briefed. You've got a plan for certain circumstances, whether it be bad weather, man overboard, fire on board. Um, you, you, you know what you would do in those situations. Third would be constantly reevaluate your environment and what's happening. Don't take anything for granted. Don't be lulled into a full sense of security. You know? I think uh, not to fall overboard. And this happens, uh, it's most of the cases it is done, it's, it's the end. But uh, you can have a life raft, you can have a, a rescue buoys and everything, but mostly it's too late then. It's better to uh, uh, have a, a lifeline and uh, hook it into a cockpit and never fall overboard. Be prepared uh, technically, the boat should be okay, you should uh, have two spare parts and certain knowledge how to behave when something uh, happens. Yeah, if he's, he's nice to me, so I say and uh, I put the, the life raft, if not... One, preparation. Two, practice and training. And three... I would say always sail within your limits. That's uh, both the boat and the crew. Don't get tired. Don't sail with too much sail. No uh, drinks. <laughs> no alcohol. <laughs> prepare and plan with the weather. So don't go into something that you're not prepared to handle. Are you talking about equipment or just anything? So you need the equipment. So what's the most important? A boat that works. A carbon life raft? A boat. The boat <laughs> is of course the most important. But the boat is in good condition. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that you, you trust your boat and that you don't push it. Because the boat, the weather... Paper. I, I don't life know, raft. I think maybe life raft. So that if, if your boat catches on fire or something, I would go for life raft. Safety equipment. Yeah, yeah. safety equipment. Ooh. Take care about you. This is important. So all the time you have something to drink, to eat. And uh, that you have all the time your head on what's happened when something happened what you're doing and if you if you have a little problem you should and you think about to uh, uh, fix it maybe in two hours it's too late if you see something do it now you should take care about your safety systems everything the uh, the flare guns the, the uh, life raft this is uh, important when I leave this center I all, always hook me in, there's a lifeline, I hook me in and go in the front and all the time, if I fell over, I can go back, I, I hope. Have a boat in tip-toe condition, have it and maintain it in tip-toe condition, good weather forecasting system and seamanship. In order to have everything uh, working for you, you need to be as prepared as possible, you, the boat, the crew, uh, choosing your uh, battles or the windows uh, for long passages is crucial. Thanks for watching. In the final episode, cruisers will share with us the length of their cruising experience and their plans for future.